Watch it. Don't spill that. We said this before we started. Oh, yeah, sure. And let everybody in on our little paint party. I hope this stuff does what it says it will. For your sake, I hope it does. Hey, hey, hey. You know, I'm getting a little sick and tired of this. Since when did you or Stark doubt me? Since we're all anxious. Yeah, including that nurse Schmidt. You know, sometimes I get the feeling that woman is calling the shots. Hey, don't let Stark hear you say that. It's true, isn't it? He said that this cylinder switch was her idea. Yes, and a good one, too. Now, almost too good. Are you sure you can trust him? Absolutely. He's been with El Presidente for years. <laughs> That's what I mean. Where's her loyalties? The point is, loyalties beside the point. After many years of service with El Presidente, she wants more. Yeah. What did Stark promise her? The moon or what? He's paying her a fortune. Well, let's hope that a fortune is enough. Hand me that. I can't tell the difference. Exactly. <laughs> the deadly carbon monoxide gas is now the savior of life. We're here. Just in time. Yeah. Go ahead. Mark it. This way. Schmidt, we'll know which one is lethal. Yeah. You're all set to do the delivery. He should be arriving just about now. Hmm? If Rico says he's reliable as he said he is. Oh, yes, a true patriot, huh? That's her now. I'd like to meet her. Um, General, uh, Mr. Yes. Schmidt, I'd like you to meet my partner. This is Sean Donnelly. Miss Schmidt, how do you do? How do you do, Nurse Schmidt? Is this your first visit to our country? Yes, we are expecting a very important shipment of oxygen. You will excuse us. Oh, well, Amy will handle that for you. Oh, uh, Nurse Schmidt is a uh, perfectionist. She must supervise every detail herself. <laughs> I'm impressed. I understand you've been with El Presidente for quite some time. Yes, but General Stark... Ah. I don't think so. Let's check out those canisters, huh? Did you check her out? Mm-hmm. As far as I could. She seems clean. Um, may we? Oh, yes, of course, but uh, it is not necessary. We have already checked everything ourselves. Just the same. We'd like to take a look. <clears throat> of course. Of course. I commend you both. Nothing gets past you. And we try, General. We try. So you ordered these for the operation, right? Correct. And, uh, you have to use these. You can't use ones at General Hospital. Well, yes, you f forgive our paranoia about such things, but these are crucial to the success of the operation, are they not, Miss Smith? Yeah, General. They are vital. Excuse me, Nurse Smith. You seem all right to me. Thank you. I take it that means we can proceed? Yes. Uh, you know, Mrs. Lavery, I, I, I quite agree with you. It, um, we cannot be too careful. Oh, Nurse Schmidt, I forgot to say one thing. I don't like that woman. I do not like that woman. Don't worry about her. I do worry. She won't bother you now, hmm? We have to make sure of that. We can't take any chances. Yes. This will not take long. It will be all over soon. Hmm? Should we um, go visit your patient, hmm? Otto is with him. I have to take these to OR. Ah, yes. Different. What do you mean, different? Different. You know, like, strange? Oh, I expect they think that we're strange, too. That'd yeah, be right. I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Uh, all right, partner, what is it? They are strange. 
I mean, they're strange, strange. Hmm. Robert certainly isn't a fan of General Starks. Neither am I. He's, uh... I don't know. Strange. Yeah. Come on. I'm going to take a peek at Charlene and call Tiffany, huh? Oh, I forgot him. Is he okay? Yeah, he's fine. Uh, I'm going to stay the whole night, though. Yeah, I'm going to be here, too. Of course, his bodyguard and his nurse will be here also. Yeah. She actually is very good. She knows what she's doing. I'm glad you'll hear that. General? Ah, El Presidente? Uh, he's fine. If he stays stable like this, I think surgery will be fine. Oh, I commend you, Doctor. I'm going to stay the whole night also. Yeah, uh, Sean and I will. And I commend you, Mrs. Lavery. But I just want everything to run smoothly, you know? No, no, no. I always give praise where praise is due. Excuse yeah. me. Yeah. Is there a problem, Mr. Dunner? Oh, nothing we can't handle. Uh, could I talk to you for a minute? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Excuse me. Uh, I have a little bit of an emergency down yeah. at Donnelly's shipping I have to take care of. I just don't like the idea of leaving you here alone. Well, you're going to come back, aren't you? Well, of course I am. Oh, well, yeah, it's fine. Anyway. Everything's all right here. Well, just make sure you keep it that way till I get back, all right? Well, I shall. All right. Go. Alan? Even Robert? One of the doctors. No white coat. You could have fooled me. <laughs> I suppose this outfit's fooling anybody? I hope so. How many painters do we have here? Two. Myself and Doyle. Hey, hey. Not enough. Oh, oh, they didn't think I'd see you here. Yeah, yeah. well. <laughs> well, Sean, uh, Sean wasn't here, and I thought that Anna might need some assistance. Uh... Does she? No, no, I understand things are going quite smoothly. Huh. It's a very streamlined, low-profile security operation. Not like the old day, Commissioner. Guards falling all over each other. You hear that? Pretend I didn't. Well, listen, um, we won't uh, mention this to uh, Miss Lavery. We don't want to upset her. I understand. Sure. What are you doing here? I was just killing a little time, re-questioning Drago. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. I got some time on my hands. Why don't you show me your... What the... no, it's, oh, it's nothing you don't already know. I mean... Besides, I, I got to, uh, you know, Felicia at home. I, I should probably... Jack in your chain, huh? Yeah. Yeah, more like pushing the buzzer. W what well, are you doing now? Well, well uh, nothing, I, I guess. Um, uh, I can show you the front door here. Why don't you uh, come to the brownstone and we'll have yeah. a beer, watch well, the Mets then, game or something? Yeah. I mean, well, if you've got nothing else, well, I don't. Look, I understand the situation.